morning students in the previous class we have learned especially about trigonometric identities and we have got three identities sin square theta theta is a theta is a equal angle plus cos square theta is equal to 1 then sec square theta minus tan square theta is equal to 1 then cosec square theta minus cot square theta is equal to 1 I hope all of you understood the identities and also I have given the relations from these identities we can obtain today I am going to start exercise 8.4. I hope all of you have remembered the relations of these identities. I already told you, no need to buy heart. Just try to solve problems using these relations of the identities. And after solving few sums, it will be automatically remembered okay today question number one express the trigonometric ratio sin a sec a and tan a in terms of cot a sin a sec a and tan a in terms of cot a first we'll try to express sin a in terms of cot a for sin a you will not get directly any relations from sin a to cot a but we have a identity that cosec square a minus cot square a is equal to 1 now question, question is what why, why I have chosen this identity because once you get the value of cosec a we know that the reciprocal of cosec a is sin a so we will get sin a that is why I have taken this one so cosec square a minus cot square a is equal to 1 so cosec square a is equal to what what you can write 1 plus cot square a and if you take out the square then you will get root over 1 plus cot square a from 11 side if you take out the square then you will get root over 1 plus cot square a now see we need sin and cot this side so we can write cosec a is equal to 1 by sin a and this side what 1 plus cot root over 1 plus cot square a so therefore sin a is equal to 1 by root over 1 plus cot square a so we have expressed sin a in terms of cot a next sec a uh, there is no relation directly from sec to cot but we have a identity sec square a minus tan square is equal to 1 so you can write sec square is equal to what 1 plus tan square a sec square is equal to what you can write tan square a you can write 1 by what cot square a if you take lcm then cot square a then cot square a plus 1 if you take out the square from the 11th side you will get whole root over cot square a plus 1 by cot square a then for cot square a plus 1 you can write root over 1 plus cot square a but for this cot square a you can cancel the square root then what is left only cot a so that is how you can write sec a is equal to root over 1 plus cot square a by cot a now what do you need tan a in terms of cot a so all of you know this because cot a is the reciprocal of tan a in terms of cot a it's very very easy means that directly you can write tan a is equal to 1 by cot a okay I have all of you understood this one. Next. Next. Question number. Question number 3 1. Evaluate sin square 63 plus sin square 27 by cos square 17 plus cos square 73. Here you can see that 63 and 27. 90 minus 27 is what 63 or 90 minus 63 is what 27 so you can use the uh, relations of uh, the, this whole what we have learned uh, in the earlier classes that uh, sin 90 minus theta cos theta cos 90 minus theta sin theta you can use this one see so this one I have write, written sin square 63 then sin square 27 see maybe you are giving confusion because of the square but it's not a problem see we know that sin theta is equal to cos 90 minus theta and cos theta is equal to sin 90 minus theta for square you can use the same thing see 
sin square theta that means if sin theta is cos 90 minus theta then sin square theta is cos 9 cos square 90 minus theta you can write similarly this cos square 7, 17 i have written sin square 90 minus theta because cos theta you can write sin 90 minus theta and this one is as it is i have written cos square 73 now sin square 63 cos square 90 minus 27 is 63 then sin square 73, 90 minus 73, 17 is 73, then cos square 73. Now we have identity that sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1. So theta is the equivalent angle. So here you can see sin square 63, cos square 63. If you use that identity sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1, then we will get sin square 63 plus cos square 63 is equal to 1. And sin square 73 plus cos square 73 is also equal to 1. So 1 by 1 is 1. Clear? Okay. Question number 4. Having some uh, MCQs, see uh, question number four one nine sec square minus ten nine ten square nine sec square minus nine ten square. So there are four options. So for this we have to simplify what they have given this one. So after that which one uh, what is the result? That means we will get that result. Result we will find out in the options okay see so here 9 sec square minus 9 10 is square you can get take common what 9 then what is left sec square minus 10 is square then this is identity or not sec square minus 10 is square you already got sec square theta minus 10 is square theta is equal to 1 or that means sec square minus 10 is square is equal to 1 9 into 1 9 so there is option 9 so you can so that is one is correct next, next question number 3 sec a plus 10 a 1 minus sin a okay see in a trigonometry, uh, actually, when you are going to simplify, I want to give you a suggestion that uh, first of all, try to convert all the ratios in terms of sine or cos. Okay? Then, secondly, simplify it, you will get the result. In many cases, you can find out easily answers by uh, expressing in sine, sine or cos. In some special cases, you can do directly. Uh, about this, I will tell you later. Okay. So uh, uh, here, sec a. As I told you, try to uh, express in sine or cos. So, sec a, you can express one by cos a because reciprocal of sec is one by cos. Ten. What is ten? Ten a. Already I told you. Sine a by cos a. But this is already in terms of sine. So uh, uh, sine and already sine so one minus sine. A. Now LCM cos a cos a LCM is cos a. Then what we can write then as numerator 1 plus sin a then 1 into sin a now see a plus b a minus b so you can write a square minus b square means 1 square minus sin square so what is 1 square 1 square is what 1 if it is 1 then 1 minus sin square is what i have already given the relations 1, one minus sin square is, is sin a so the cos square a so 1 minus sin square is is, is cos square cos so cos square and then what is cos then if you cut it then you will get means divide it then you will get cos the result is cos you can choose the correct option as cos okay okay then uh, as homework i have given this question question number two question number three two question number four two and four this question number four is mcq but don't write the option only please try to simplify and and choose the option you have to write the simplification okay and you have to show me okay then even in case any doubt or confusion you can ask me in the evening god bless you